There was this guy recently, um, you know, on, on the YouTube channel, every Wednesday I run this AMA show, Ask Me Anything, right? And there was this guy I called up, um, and then he said to me, he said, I really wanted to manifest, uh, no, 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 he said, he said, I Eric, I need your help. I said, what's the question? He said, where do I find investors? And I said, oh, wow. I said, um, okay. I said, why? And he said, well, I've been trying to manifest this for a long time, but it's my manifestation kind of isn't working. I don't know why, you know, trying to manifest investors. And I said, what's the thing? He said, well, I do shoes, sneakers, and I've got this design and stuff like that. And I said, oh, that sounds pretty cool. And I said, actually, can I let you in on a secret? Would you like to know the secret? Yes. Lean forward for me. <laughs> Ask me, Eric, what's the secret? I said to him, I said, um, actually, <laughs> I'll let you into a secret. Your manifestation worked. And he said, what do you mean? I said, because I'm an investor and I've invested in fashion before, so I'm here. <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> <laughs> then, uh, then, uh, then, 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 uh, then I said to him, I said, okay, so cool, just tell me what the thing is. Then he spent the next 10 minutes or so trying to explain what the thing is. And then in the middle of it, I just said, I said, actually, I, I, don't, I can't figure out what you are saying. I said, so can I give you some very, 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 very important advice? And he said, yes. He said, what is it? I said, well, it's like this. Okay. I want you guys to listen carefully. There's no such thing as law of attraction not working for you or manifestation not working for you. Because thought goes into reality. It's happening all the time. Right? Everything starts from thought. We came to agreement with that one, yes? Thought is vibration. Vibrations attract. And this is just natural, right? Yeah, everything works in that way. So there's no such thing when you say law of attraction isn't working. It's working all of the time. Okay? So that's number one. Number two is that when we think of something in this like energetic sense, we are this energy in a physical body. Is that true? So it means just by playing with energy, it's very hard to do a physical manifestation, complete the whole thing from start to finish. If we imagine it like this, we are writing our order, our wish list, and we are sending it to universe. <laughs> yeah. Just like ordering on Amazon, a bit like that. Okay. So we are ordering in energy form. We are sending it off. Energy will always, it'll be there. The connection's there. It's happening. Okay? So that's happening. But the big problem is, in amongst all of the things you are thinking, right? Th let me ask you a question. How many of you practice some form of visualization? Some, some, like, how many of you have like a vision board? You look at it and you write your goals and things like that, you know? You're journaling. Anybody do it, yeah? Okay, so you do that stuff. Now, how many of you do that and you believe in the law of attraction? Okay. So, why don't you just manifest everything? Like, why are you sitting here? Right? The thing is this, you are manifesting everything. So you spend, let me ask you a question, visualization, how long do you spend in the morning doing that? 10 minutes? 30 minutes, wow, that's intense. How long? Any longer? You know, one hour, five hours. <laughs> <laughs> That's all I do. <laughs> okay, right. Let's say how how long are the longer ones? Half an hour, right? They're pretty pretty much very intense already, right? <laughs> Visualizing in the morning every morning for half an hour. Okay, so let's just take your brain capacity. You take or in your energy and your time spent and everything. You take half an hour manifesting the thing that you really want. Okay, let me ask, so thought equals reality. Yes, thought equals vibration equals reality. True. Now. So you spend 20 minutes doing that, half an hour doing that. What about the other 23.5 hours? What are you thinking about? What are you thinking about? Over the next 23.5 hours, what are you thinking about? Everything else, huh? 
I need to reply to those emails. Okay, I need to make that phone call I really dread making right now. I don't know how to answer this, this person. This person's messaging me. Okay, emails coming in, work stuff, home stuff, pick the kids up from school, everything happening at the same time. What should I do tomorrow, right? Some of you have so much to think about. It's kind of like you open up the wardrobe and what shall I wear today is already enough stress and worry for the whole day, right? It's kind of like... I haven't got anything to wear, right? You got the whole wardrobe. <laughs> <laughs> so, this is your thought and your worries and your stress, which is all vibrations. We thought, vibration, vibration, attraction, everything is law of attraction. So, what that means is, in amongst your million dollar manifestation <laughs> that you do for 20 minutes a day, it's like, boop. <laughs> and in amongst that, in the reality, there's everything else that is manifested, right? Everything that you don't want becomes manifestation too. You don't just manifest what you want, you manifest what you don't want, right? Why am I keep attracting people like that? Vibration, more of that, <laughs> you know? Okay, so everything at the same time. Now, identifying which one was the manifestation is already uh, going to be a task for you. Does that make sense? But receiving in the physical form receiving the manifestation is even more of a task because you need the tools the skills to be able to recognize where is your package give you an example in your mind in the morning you manifest girl of your dreams exact specification And then what happens is you're like, 20 minutes, it's a long time. 30 minutes, that's extended a bit, you know? I want it faster. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So that's 30 minutes, okay? Now what happens is all the way through the day, why do I keep meeting people like this? What an idiot, what are that, and this and that, and all the rest of the stuff. All into attraction too, right? Comes the next day. You are stood in front of this room, inside this room. What if I was to tell you that every single person inside this room was your manifestation? What if I was to tell you that every single thing that happens to you is your manifestation? Now, don't even think about your conscious thinking right now. We're talking about subconscious thinking that you don't even know you think about. What if everything was a manifestation? Now, now I'm in a room with, what, 150 people. What I'm doing is I'm looking around, I'm saying, why does law of attraction not work? Where is that specification I asked for? <laughs> nah, it's not working. This damn law of attraction stuff, you know? It don't work, okay? It's because there's too much you're manifesting. So how can you spot the one? Is already one. The second thing is, right? You need to understand in this physical form how things are delivered. What does that mean? Right. Manifestation is not like this. It's not like money, 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 money. Ah, money! <laughs> right? That's not how manifestation works, right? Have you seen anybody share their manifestation story and that was how it went? You know, girl of my dreams, girl of my dreams, girl of my dreams, girl of my dreams, girl of my dreams. Ah! <laughs> you know? it's, it's not like that, right? It's not open your eyes, boom, there it is, right? Why? Everything is like this. You are placing an order on Amazon. You send it off. Okay? What determines the speed, whether you are Amazon Prime or not, okay, is right, how much emotions you have towards the manifestation because emotion is energy in motion. The more emotions, the vibrational frequency is much stronger. So that's why it's a faster attraction. So that's your Amazon Prime. Now, you just Amazon Prime the shit out of that thing. So what actually happens is, now how does Amazon deliver that thing that you, that camera, okay? That camera does not go, camera, wah! What happens is, somebody looking like David knocks on your door. Now, imagine you seeing that opening your door. You're a person. He says, yeah, I'm the delivery man. No, I ordered a camera. Shut the door. <laughs> right? It needs a delivery boy. Not only it needs a delivery boy, sometimes within that package, right, 
And how do you receive the package? What does the package look like? Okay. These are the things that, right now, may be a lot of question marks. So anyway, this manifestation kind of happened. So I said, I'm here. <laughs> And then I said, explain to me what the thing is. He went round in circles, circles, circles. And I said, so let me give you the best piece of advice I could give you. Okay? Your manifestation worked 100%. I'm calling you right now. I could have called thousands of people. There's 375 or 80,000 people on the channel. I called you. What does that say? Your manifestation has worked. So you found the investor you're looking for. Right? But I said, you are here, a human being in this physical form. When an investor is in front of you, what tools do you use to get the investment? That you never asked. What is your pitch? Because I said, hearing that thing, I said, first of all, I don't know how much money I need to put in yet. Second of all, it doesn't even sound like I make money out of this project. Right? It sounds like some charity thing. I said, that's not what investors are looking for. I said, so it doesn't make any sense. Have you got the tools to receive the package right now? Number one, identify the package. Number two, how do you receive it? How does law of attraction work? Right? Let's say I want to meet the girl of my dreams. Manifest, 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 manifest. Right? Every time I open my eyes, I see David in front of me. <laughs> I'm just like, what am I doing wrong? Right? So at every single event, David is always there, right? I'm thinking, I want the girl of my dreams. Go for dinner, go for dinner, go for dinner, you know? And every single time at an event, David's like, Eric, shall we go for dinner sometime? I'm just like, this is manifestation went wrong here, you know? It just, <laughs> that's not what I ordered. Now, what if this? What if this was the delivery boy? What if by saying, and feeling and knowing that this is part of the manifestation because there are dots that connect to a manifestation, I say, okay, okay, let's go for dinner. And what if I go for dinner and at that dinner table, some waitress, which is the girl of my dreams, appears and I'm just like, huh? Isn't that how everything has shown up in your life so far? You're telling me that you had planned to go to a place to exactly meet that exact person, that's the exact place and time that you met. No. Everything was accidental. Do you get what I'm saying here? Give me an aha. Take a deep breath in. And out. <laughs>